Base frame is formed using the triple layer boat spherical note system in general and four layer about the hangar door location in a weighted 625 ton. The space frame will be assembled on the ground and lifted in place at a time. 1. Installation of lifting towers. Six sets of lifting towers will be set up at a designated lifting point locations that are precisely set out and checked on site to make sure they are exactly located at the required positions. Mobile crane will erect the pre-assembled standard units. Tie wires will be installed when five or more units are erected. After the verticality of the towers are found satisfactory, steel frames and two steel beams will be installed at the top with bolt joints. Then steel floor plates and safety fence will be provided at the top of towers. Lifting cable will pass through the jack and the hole on the floor and then connect it to the space frame. Tie wires are used to connect the lifting towers together for structural stability in both directions and lateral load transfer to the base of the adjacent steel columns. All the temporary lifting towers have to be checked and verified by registered professional engineers by load test. 2. Assembly of space frame on the ground. Site conditions shall be inspected and found suitable before the assembly of space frame members. It is to ensure the exact position of nodes of lowest layer at a grid line F and for future setting out. To provide the rigidity of space frame, temporary supports will be provided to certain bottom nodes. A team will be assigned to assemble the nodes and tubes at the bottom of first row along direction. Then another team will assemble the nodes and tubes in the two lower layers of second row along the short direction of the space frame and starts the assembly of the members for the top layer of the first row. The two teams will work at the same time with the space frame in between so that their operation will not interfere each other. During the assembly, two 25-ton mobile crane will be used for lifting materials. When layers 1 and 2 of the space frame are being assembled, movable platform will be used as the working area for installation. For the layer 3, a safety rope about 1 meter above grid will be provided as the lifeline of workers. Workers will access the working areas at height by Caesar platform and aluminum ladder. 3. Lifting of space frame Upon completion of the space frame assembly and inspection, the lifting process will be carried out using the lifting towers in 5 steps. Step 1. Trial lifting stage After installation and adjustment of accessories, trial lifting can be proceeded. Lifting force will be gradually increased until the space frame is lifted by about 200 mm. Survey and inspection will be done for measuring levels of space frame for verification and record. The suspension for observation will be 12 hours. If there is no anomaly in the space frame and the lifting system, it will proceed to next stage of the lifting process. Step 2. Lifting of space frame will start. The process will take about 2 hours and the speed of vertical lifting is not more than 3 meters per hour. The space frame will be lifted to a height of 4 meters above the ground and then suspended for one day for installation of space frame at the hangar door location. At each corner of the space frame, there is a 5-tone horizontal chain block with one end fastened to lower cord and the other end fastened to the base of the steel column. After each lifting process, the chain blocks have to be tightened against the waggling of the space frame caused by external force. In bad weather, the four corners of space frame should be fixed in position by additional chain blocks and power supply should be shut down. Step 3. After the check-in and inspection of the works is done satisfactorily, the lifting of space frame will be resumed. Throughout the lifting process, two sets of tie wires will be in use alternately. The space frame will be lifted until it is 100 mm above designed elevation. Step 4. Installation of the remaining members and supports will take place along three sides of the space frame with two elevated working platforms and 25-ton mobile crane. The base plates of space frame supports will be installed to the top of steel column first, and the stiffeners are also prefabricated to the space frame. Site welding will be carried out for the connections between the stiffeners and the base plates. Step 5. The lifting force of space frame will be released. Setting out with respect to the grid lines and level of the space frame will be checked. Upon satisfaction, the lifting force will be released and the stiffeners will be welded to the base plates. 4. Removal of lifting tower. Mobile crane will be located such that its tip is able to penetrate through void of the space frame. It will be removed the jacks and the beams from the top of the lifting towers to the ground. Then the crane will lift the tower from the top and the components will disassemble reversely from the bottom of the tower.